check this out. I'm going to build a patch, something pretty simple, a kick drum. So we'll start by taking a gate output from the controller here, and I'm going to plug that right into the trigger input of the first channel, this dope for A142.4 quad decay. And I'm going to take the output from that quad decay and route that to the voltage input of this VCA, in this case the IntelliGel quad VCA. And we go from the VCA output to the mixer. And then we can hear nothing because there's no audio signal plugged in. What are we going to do for an audio signal? I've got this 2HP OSC and I'm going to plug the sine output into the audio input for the VCA. Now, if I hit that trigger, you hear a little boom. Yeah, that's kind of kick-like, but it is still missing something. What is it missing? It is missing pitch attack. <laughs> it's Maybe I will let the sounds speak for themselves. Uh, one of the things that's nice about this quad decay is the triggers are normaled straight down the line. So one trigger can produce a different length decays. Yeah, because the first trigger, as long as nothing's plugged into the subsequent trigger input, the signal goes straight down the line. So I'm going to use this second output and route that to the frequency modulation input of the OSC, but I'm going to make one pit stop along the way. I'm going to route this to uh, an attenuator, and this isn't exactly an attenuator. It is a three-way crossfader. Also another Delpford module here, the A138E three-way crossfader. Um, three inputs across the top, uh, four channels, um, three inputs for each channel, I should say, and your knob basically crossfades it from purely A on the left to purely C on the right. When there's only one input, uh, you can use it as a um, attenuator pretty easily. Uh, center detent uh, gives you no modulation at all. And then if you dial it in toward the left, you start to get more and more of the A signal as you go. Yeah, all the way to the top. And then if you go into C territory all the way to the right, it actually inverts that signal. So you get your envelope moving the opposite direction. Kind of fun. In this case, yeah, I'm going to do that. Tighten up that pitch envelope a little bit. That's nice. Make it boomy. Anyway, there is a kick drum. 